Full Tower, Macmillan Estate. Okay. Anyways, I wanted to interview you guys this little video, that way you can guys get a little heads up on the Dead by Daylight thing. Now, as you guys, if you guys actually um, watch the dev stream and everything that happened yesterday, I believe, um, they did a little uh, insight on the killer and the new map. So the killer is, as you guys will know from the Saw series, it's, oh god. I think I saw someone. No, I didn't. Anyways, the killer is from the Saw series. It is not... Oh, it's Freddy! Oh, God. Don't see me. But anyways, the killer is from the Saw series. It is not Jigsaw. It's probably not going to be... God. It's probably not going to be the little dude on the tricycle, since I'm pretty sure they said they weren't going to do any... Anything with the puppets and stuff, but someone got hit. So it's probably going to be most likely the pig. Go away! Okay, there we go. It's most likely going to be the pig. The and probably it's going to be Amanda, since um, the images so far that we've seen have been of that of the red robe and everything. And as you, if you guys have seen the Saw movies, Amanda, when she places the pig killer, usually wears the red robe and has the long black hair. So. Everyone's thinking right now it's probably going to be the pig person from there. And so far the maps that they've um, shown some things of, it actually looks pretty cool. It's basically going to have multiple layers into it. Uh, probably going to be about three, maybe four layers probably. Now the only issue I have with this is that it's probably going to do something wrong with the nurse. Since the nurse is already hard as it is to blink up multiple times. Ooh, decisive strike, nice. And it probably would cause a lot of problems for her. However, they did say in the stream that they were fixing a couple of her uh, mechanics and whatnot. So maybe you're going to be able to blink to which way you're looking at. I'm not entirely sure how they're going to do it. It seems a little far-fetched to me, but we'll see how it goes through. But some of the other perks they were talking about is... I forget the name of it, but apparently if you start sabotaging a hook, it notifies the killer that you're doing that. Just like the same as if you're killing yourself and you mess up on it. And it's the same thing for it. Um, and also, if the you actually take down the hook, she went down again. Um, it actually repairs the hook instead of it, you know, being gone. Like once the person is sacrificed, it will actually repair that same hook that they were sacrificed on. Like right now, for example, if if she was to die on that hook and it would come back to it, it would actually rebuild that hook. Oh, that's the one done. Okay, let's check down here really quick. So interesting killer so far. Apparently more of her mechanics are that um, when she crouches down, she actually has zero terror radius. Kind of like a Michael Myers, but it's absolutely zero without the use of monitor and abuse or anything. So that's pretty cool. And when she's in the crouching mode, she can do a lunge attack at you. So, and if the lunge attack, ooh, a map. No, I'm gonna keep my toolbox. But if she does the lunge attack and it actually lands, like you get hit by it, she puts a reverse bear trap on your guys' head. He's over here somewhere. And apparently if you have that thing on your head, you only have about, I don't know, maybe a minute, two minutes tops, and you have to go around the entire map and look at these little jack-in-the-boxes on the ground. And you have to open them up and there's gonna be a key inside, and either the key is going to open up your uh, bear trap, or it's going to go off and if it goes off when you're just in the normal healthy state it's probably going to bring you down a health peg we're not too sure yet so that means if you're 100 healthy it puts you into the injured state if you're um, in the injured state it's going to bring you down to the dying state uh probably oh and it also said that they can also put it on your head when you're in the dying state and if you don't get it off you you're instantly sacrificed so get out of here no one knows really how that's going to go so far. Can I go back? I'm gonna go back. But it seems pretty weird so far. So either the killer is going to be overpowered, underpowered. Everyone said that Freddy was overpowered when he first came out and he wasn't actually that bad and then they nerfed him to the ground. So hopefully they don't do it with this one. Okay, let's get out of here because he's gonna be coming. But I'm also wondering to see who the survivor is going to be. 
Now, if it's going to be Amanda, then it's probably going to be one of the survivors that Amanda is the killer in. So it's got to be one of the survivors. I haven't seen really any of the Saw movies. I All I know is the basic knowledge that they did from the dev uh, live stream yesterday. That's all I really know about it. God, you scared me. So far, I don't really know what this killer's doing. I haven't came into contact with these ant attack, so we gotta run. Okay, let's find one more generator and we can get out of here. But interesting killer so far. I am excited to see. Oh god, I need to hide somewhere. Is he gonna take him to this hook? Yep. That terror radius is really small. Really small. I don't see any grass moving. Oh my god, he's <laughs> about to check the corner. Oh, why? You took my... Yo! Well, time to run. He probably locked down some of the generators. Oh, he's going over here. I'm coming to help you. Hold on, Dwight. I am here. It's my twin. Hello? Yeah. Okay. Heal. Yeah, I have leader on. You should probably follow me. First, let's get some more extra points. It looks like she's getting chased and not at the same time. Let's go this way. Oh, okay, so she was getting chased. I thought so. It looked like it. Find a Jenny, attach myself to it, get it done, and get out of here. Oh, he's gonna go to that one, and I'm gonna try. I wonder if the one on the second floor of the building is done. Let's go find out. Never mind, she's dead, so we're probably going to die too. Okay, he's gone. So they're both in the dream state right now. So if I can get this done, I can put... Okay, come on. I gotta get this done so I can save them. Or at least get myself out. Come on. We can do this. Just keep him busy for a little bit longer. And keep him away from the house. Oh, okay. I'll wake you up. And help me with this. Help me with this, please. I have leader on. I have my thing. Please hurry. Please hurry. I don't want to die. Oh, we got this. We got this. Crap. Exit gate there. Exit gate there. Oh, I was him checking the lock. Okay, he's gone. I'm going to potentially try and open up a gate. Open it up. Open it. I will take the sleep hit from you. Oh, yes, no one escapes death. We need to go. We need to go right now. <laughs> oh my god, please. He must have had Remember Me on. There we go. We got away. Fantastic. I'm not going to wait around either, so let's just go. 
Okay, that was an interesting game. Pretty good so far. Did we go up a rank? We did. We went up to 14. And he instantly left. Doesn't know how to play Freddy that well. You don't focus the obsession if you're Freddy. If you're, especially if you use using Remember Me. You still have to gradually, you know, put it out there for everyone else. Barely ranked up to you. All right. Play with your food? Questionable. Well, he tried. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video so far. And let me know if the face cam thing's working so far. If it does, I'm just gonna keep doing it. Cause so far, I know a lot of you guys have been requesting for me to do the face cam and now I found out a way to do it. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. Make sure to hit a like up on this video and subscribe if you guys already haven't. Make sure to tell everyone about the channel as well. We're growing pretty fast right now. We're up to think 64 subscribers. That's pretty quick. Also, make sure to leave down a comment. Let me know if you guys wanna do any of my other music covers. And oh, also let you guys know, I will be posting videos every single Tuesday and every single Thursday, just to clarify that for everyone, because a lot of the people didn't know what days I was doing it. I never specified it, so again, it's my fault I didn't do it. But again, I put them up every Tuesday and Thursday. They usually go up uh, late at night because I, I'm falling asleep as they're uploading. That way I, I don't know, just, I don't know, I prefer it that way. So they're gonna be up late at night for you guys to watch or early in the morning whenever you get time. And also make sure to hit that little notification bell. That way you guys always get notified whenever I post up the new videos. So it'll hopefully it doesn't wake you guys up in the middle of the night, but it'll be there for you right when you wake up. So hopefully you guys enjoyed the video so far and I'll catch you guys next time. Peace out.